What's up, everybody? My name is Jason, and welcome to the Small Biz Podcast. I've got to tell you guys, I'm exhausted. I am completely famished. I sit here today in a room, 12 by 12, speaking into my Tascam Mixcast 4 podcast studio platform. I've messed around with a Minolta 4K, the webcam on my 24-inch iMac, my smartphone, something called an Oswat, if I can pronounce that correctly, camera. It looks like a periscope that you might see in Red October. And I must confess, right out of the gate, I have no fucking idea what I'm doing. My dear friend, Pauly the Magician, and John, who specializes in home theaters, I'll have a lot more to say about both, in the near future, are either home or on their way back to Florida. And let it be known that they didn't have to do this. They brought a few thousand dollars worth of equipment up here that I'm still trying to figure out how it works. Because they see something in me. They seem to think, along with some friends of theirs that have Huge podcast audiences that I got something. That the 7 million views that I've created on YouTube over the last two years plus, mostly with respect to EIDL, could translate into tens of thousands of podcast listeners and watchers on YouTube, of course, just like you. So I sat here thinking, man, I really want to go to McDonald's. All right, I've been trying to lose weight, and it's hard. I'll be 53 on April 13th, and anybody who's my age knows it's difficult to lose weight once you cross 50 as a man. Testosterone starts going down. Things start sagging. Stuff starts hurting that you didn't even know you had. And I said, rather than try to pretend that we've got it all figured out because we don't, I mean, we've spun this desk around three times. We've moved those LED lights here, there, out in the hall, pointed them down, pointed them up to the ceiling. We tried it all. I said, rather than try to pretend that I've got this all figured out, why not just be honest with people, as I tend to be, and put it out there, warts and all, humble beginnings, admitting that I have no fucking idea how to work all those buttons. That's a flat line. That's a heartbeat. I don't know if you can hear that. Oh, this is going to be fun. Oh, we're going to get this figured. <laughs> so I'd ask you, please subscribe to this channel. Hit the bell. We have 75,000 subscribers, 98% of which haven't watched a single video of mine in the last six months. But I aim to change all that by covering, among other things, the stock market. I know. I know. I know. It's ugly. GMBL after the COMS disaster, but LHDX looks like it's coming back. XCLA is going the wrong direction. We've taken it on the chin in the last, oh, let's call it 72 hours. But after you make over a thousand percent on your money, folks, and I've said this before, I'll say it again, a 20 to 30 percent drawdown, especially now, is normal. You can't make eight, eight, nine, eight, 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 eight. That's all, folks. You can't make eight, nine, ten times on your money and not experience a 20, 30, maybe even 35% drawdown from time to time. It's going to happen. But if you net out over 100 winners combined with only 11% of our trades being losers, we're still way, way, way ahead of the game. In fact, if you got it in the beginning, you're still up about 800%.